I am just chill as fuck about being a pale friend to all varieties of cute and eligible as hell peeps. Do you see my shoulder and how it says, hey friend, please deposit tears here? That is a legit invite and is like sincere as fucking bananas. Shane never believed my crap, never any of my warnings about the Baroness, didn't believe the stuff about my mom, and so on and so on and so on, till after a while I just stopped even trying to convince her hard or bring up any crazy shit, because you know, doing a lot of songs and dances to convince somebody who thinks you're just shitting them all the time kinda wears on a friendship. Exactly. Therefore, you must believe me when I say, if Dirk lets on all his feelings, there is at least a chance Jake will go like, Derp, okay, dude, let's make out. And that means poor Jane is screwed without even ever throwing her filthy old fedora in the ring. Then Dirk wakes up and kicks my squeamish butt out of the way and kisses her even in spite of his superhuman gayness because he sucks less as a hero. This is fascinating, if a wee bit more dissertation than I bargained for this morning. I have so much to learn. And I am not even saying that ironically. Will you teach me your ways one day, sir? Perhaps an apprenticeship will open? Are you sure? I have my doubts. I believe as a group we will have the temerity to succeed without my having to order people around like an insufferable bossy pants. Roxy, I can see you're set on just wasting more of my time. I understand if you don't wish to play this game, but please try not to interfere with those of us who do. I'm feeling so friendly! I clearly just want to be a good friend and bring all my amazing friendliness to bear on your problems. Friendly style! <laughs> uh, shit, I mean... <laughs> there you are. Tricky one to track down you are. Oh yes, everyone is having important dreams as we near our mutual entries. This is lovely. Please tell. I confirmed no such thing, Roxy. You are being frightfully difficult. You just keep pushing and pushing and pushing and I can maintain my composure for only so long. I'm so pleased to hear you are leaning in favor of participating with the rest of us. I promise we'll all have a ball together. Oh, I could just wrangle you. You don't even know how tempted I am to do so right now. I did not break the rules. I was doing you a favor. In any case, you say you managed to beat me? When did that happen? Even though you've exposed your ruse, you haven't actually made me yet, Grandmaster Bro! Rolling my eyes here, can you see? Do you want me to light them up for you? Don't you think it can come across as a series of affectations designed to overcompensate for an implicit flaw with your gender? An act which rebuts what should be a straw man, with a cartoonish masquerade that with every kickflip and high five screams, Yes, it appears that girls can be as radical and as good at games as boys, thus lending a certain dignity to the premise at the expense of your own. All these sweeps and you still act like such a wiggler sometimes. Hey, is that... Is that grub sauce on your face? Let's stay in touch, Kanaya. Come looking for me in your dreams anytime. And be sure not to let that one too far out of your sight. You know how it is! A girl's gotta sacrifice understandability for the sake of radness sometimes! Do you even know how lame of a scene it is being the only legit in your face power gaining girl and a bunch of bubbles full of brittle posers? Oh, why didn't you say? So, sounds like a rad plan, and you know how I feel about the rad plan. Girl, who doesn't want to be me? You think you can just waltz into this bubble and start being any rad gamer girl you cross paths with? What you talking about, girl? Mina, where'd you go? Come help me be cynical about this. Ugh. No, I will not clam them. They will stay wildly and gleefully unclammed because, and I repeat, mug. Mina, I missed you so much! Why didn't we ever hang out when we were alive? I had so much time to ponder that, and it's one of my deepest regrets. And the shipping! You won't even believe who got together over the sweeps! And the quadrants, the quadrants they paired up in! It will blow your mind! I don't even think I am able to convey how much... I can't, I just can't, I am completely unable to can right now! You don't understand, Mina. The feels. The feels! I've been keeping an eye on you all for quite a while. Your whole planet, actually. It was very interesting this time around, to say the least. It even had a different name, Alternia. <laughs> How heavy-handed can you get? Everybody? Excuse me, are you listening? 
I would like to introduce you to someone. His name is... Hey! Mina, I said cut it the fuck out! Yes, you, the dead miscreant with the goggles waving around the stupid trident. Put it down! There's more to the realization of our roles than gaining flashy powers. And there's more to healing than repairing battle damage. You killed a friend and you understandably feel regret. But it's done. She is gone and you are still here. Now what? If you speak for everyone with respect to what is most interesting to talk about, then what is your proposal? I mean proposal! Stupid infectious fish pun. Took all of five minutes to pull me into your insanity again. Insanity! Ugh. Which troll am I? I'm the best troll, dummy. Now get away from her, she's mine. Attention, huh? Who'd have thought you'd want any of that? Come on, let me puncture one of them. Just a little. How about this shout-ass nubby mother glover who looks like what's-his-face? Aw, oh, shell no! Why would I tell a hornless dork like you something like that? あなたは私の胸を一度も表示することができます。黙れ。そう。あなたはまだ彼と別れたのですか。ハマグリは真珠を生成しません。あなたは海の何も知らない。私は何も後悔はありません。<笑>